Credit Score Explained In this video we have an important topic to discuss, credit scores. If you've ever wondered what a credit score is, how it's calculated, and why it matters, you're in the right place. By the end of this video, you'll have a clear understanding of credit scores and their significance in your financial life. So, let's dive right in. Section 1, What is a Credit Score? First things first, let's define what a credit score is. A credit score is a three-digit number that represents your creditworthiness. In simple terms, it's a numerical summary of how reliable you are as a borrower. Lenders use the score to assess the risk of lending you money, whether it's for a credit card, mortgage, car loan, or any other form of credit. Section 2. How is a credit score calculated? The calculation of your credit score is based on several factors, and the weight of each factor may vary depending on the credit scoring model. However, the most common factors include 1. Payment history. This is the most significant factor and involves looking at whether you make your payments on time. 2. Credit utilization. This refers to the percentage of your available credit that you're using. Lower utilization is generally better for your score. 3. Length of credit history. The longer you have a credit history, the better, as it demonstrates your ability to manage credit over time. 4. Types of credit. A mix of different types of credit, such as credit cards, loans, and a mortgage, can positively impact your score. 5. New credit inquiries. Opening multiple new credit accounts in a short period may negatively affect your score. Section 3. Credit score ranges. Credit scores typically fall within a range, and these ranges may vary depending on the scoring model used. The most common credit score range is 300 to 850. Here's how scores are generally categorized. Excellent, 750 and above. Good, 700 to 749. Fair, 650 to 699. Poor, 600 to 649. Bad, below 600. Section 4. Why does your credit score matter? Your credit score plays a crucial role in many aspects of your financial life. A higher credit score opens doors to better financial opportunities, including lower interest rates on loans and credit cards. It can also make it easier to get approved for a rental apartment, utilities without a deposit, or even a job in some cases. On the other hand, a lower credit score can result in higher interest rates, limited access to credit, and even difficulty in getting approved for a loan or credit card. That's why it's essential to understand your credit score and take steps to improve it if necessary. Section 5. How to Improve Your Credit Score If you have a less-than-ideal credit score, don't worry. There are several steps you can take to improve it over time. Here are some tips. 1. Pay your bills on time, every time. 2. Reduce your credit card balances and maintain a low credit utilization rate. 3. Avoid opening unnecessary new credit accounts. 4. Check your credit report regularly for errors and dispute any inaccuracies. 5. Consider becoming an authorized user on a friend or family member's credit card with a positive payment history. Conclusion and there you have it, a comprehensive guide to understanding credit scores. Remember, your credit score is a valuable financial tool, so it's crucial to manage it responsibly. Whether you're looking to buy a car, a house, or simply want to maintain a healthy financial life, your credit score will always be an essential factor. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button so you don't miss any future content. If you have any questions or comments, please let us know in the comments section below.